Turn up! Truth it now. Truth it. 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 What up, guys, people? This is your boy, Will, and this is another episode of Truth It. Today is a my, my, my Friday. My, my, my. My people in need of some encouragement. He about to preach, y'all. The kingdom of God is for you to inherit. 2 Corinthians 5.17 said, Old things are passed away. Behold, all things have become new. Truth It. So with that said, we got to start walking in that. Unfortunately, some of the most depressed people I see on Twitter and Facebook are Christians. Look, I understand we got problems, and truth be told, I suffer from depression. Oh lord, he put his business on front street. There is nothing wrong with venting. People drive me crazy sometimes. But you have to ask yourself, who are you attracting to Christ if your face is always sad today, I'll be angry tomorrow, depressed after that, tired after that. Upset and treated unfairly the day after that. But come to God, because he answers all prayers. That ain't biblical. Psalm 55, 22 says, cast your cares upon the Lord and he will sustain you. Not cast your cares to Twitter or Facebook. If Jesus had a Twitter, he would unfollow some of y'all. Truth is, we have to really evaluate ourselves and say, where is our faith? My, my, my. In the book of Matthew chapter 8, the apostles were on the boat with Jesus during a storm. They were crying out to him and they woke him up. He was sleeping and they said, Lord, save us. Jesus said, oh, ye of little faith, why are you afraid? Truth it. The struggle is real and we all are going through some storms sometimes. And there's nothing wrong with calling up a fellow person in Christ and saying, look, brother, I need prayer. Let's fast together. Let's go to the pastor. Let's go to this person. Let me go to my mentor. Let me go to someone who can really help me with my problems. That's why God placed him in your life. Truth it. But if I'm a non-believer and I don't know if I trust in or really believe in God or not, and I try to look towards the Christians to see how they live in their life and what God's doing in their lives, and all I see is depression, anxiety, anger, and, and, and just strife, that ain't going to make me want to go to Christ. That's going to make me run the opposite way. And there are some Christians on Facebook and Twitter that are going through it. And I know their stuff personally. I ain't going to air out their business. But... They are still living and walking in a, with a positive attitude. It's like they got Joyce Meyer on 24-7. So the next time you update your status, ask yourself, is this for the kingdom or against the kingdom? Am I showing how strong my faith is or am I showing how little faith I have? Let's go to the rock on my Bible. This is a rock with scripture on it. Uh, one of my dearest friends gave this to me. Uh, maybe a couple years ago, and I, I've always kept it with me because I love what the scripture says on it. Jeremiah 17, 7. Blessed is the man who trusts in the Lord. Truth it. So today, I want to see everybody sharing the good news of the gospel. And let's treat it like how we treat people. If you ain't got nothing nice to say, don't say nothing at all. Truth it. That's all I got for today. This is Will, and I'm out.